Or split up on both sides? Uh, just stay where you are. Okay. If you want to split up a little bit, it's up to you. If you used to kind of be out of the shot, yeah, it's ready. Me or him? <laughs> yep. So is all the way over here. Okay. <laughs> is it good? Good. You ready? All right. Well, good morning, and thank you all for being here for our Thanksgiving uh, dinner packing and distribution event. You know, today's been a very uplifting uh, day where our community partners and our business partners have all come together. You know, they all showed up uh, today to help uh, stuff a thousand bags with uh, sides to go along with uh, either a turkey or a Cornish hen. And then uh, later, our amazing community resource officers are going to deliver those meals to uh, a thousand uh, families that have been identified in the communities that they serve. Um, you know, Thanksgiving is, of course, a time. Uh, you know, where we want to reflect on what we're thankful for. And I'm certainly thankful for our great partners at the Denver Police Foundation, uh, AT&T, uh, We Don't Waste, as well as uh, Walmart. Um, I'm also thankful for our volunteers, our Denver Police officers, who all showed up today to help uh, stuff these thousand bags. And lastly, I'm thankful to those uh, in our community who uh, share with us their lived experience and let us know opportunities where we can, where we can help them when they're in need, particularly in the holiday season. Uh, so at this time, I'd like to specifically recognize Guillermo Lombari, uh, the Director of External Affairs at External at uh, AT&T Colorado. I'm Guillermo. Oh, thank you, Chief. Wow, so yes, definitely an uplifting morning. Uh, it's really incredible to see the partnership and how those bags came together. I mean, it was a thousand bags and they put them together in an hour. And we have some uh, wonderful AT&T volunteers here as well that helped with that, so very exciting. It's the fourth year AT&T has partnered with the Denver Police Foundation uh, to help provide these meals. And it's something that we're extremely proud of. As the chief said, Thanksgiving is such a special holiday. Um, all about being with family and community. And these meals uh, will allow for the officers to connect with those families and communities. And in addition, allow those families to have a proper Thanksgiving meal to, to sit down uh, you know, that night and enjoy together. So we're really, really grateful to be able to provide that. Um, you know, we know that families continually rely on AT&T and our networks to stay closer uh, to home for safety, for learning, for business and relying on our technology and network more than ever before, before to stay connected to families and friends. Uh, at AT&T, we build networks that help connect both families, businesses, as well as first responders with our, uh, through our FirstNet uh, network, uh, which is a nationwide build network dedicated to, to first responders across the country. Uh, through the AT&T Foundation, we support local nonprofits to drive economic empowerment and, and equity including our digital divide efforts across Colorado and AT&T employee volunteer efforts across the state. So we hope today that our $15,000 contribution to the Denver Police Foundation and our volunteer efforts around this Thanksgiving outreach event with the department truly make a difference. Uh, they have created many wonderful outreach programs the foundation has and are helping build bridges in the Denver community at, at a time when it's truly needed. The Denver uh, Police Department sees the challenges families face every single day. Uh, the distribution of, this, of these meals can be shared by families is a sincere act of kindness, especially as many, as many families are finding it harder and harder to make ends meet. We're uh, very thankful for the work of the Police Department, uh, the Foundation, for all you guys do for our communities, um, keeping us safe. We're, we're extremely grateful for that. Um, so at this time, uh, I want to hand it over to Megan Pletcher, who's the Executive Director of the Foundation, and wish you all a happy holiday. Thank you. Thank you, Guillermo. The Denver Police Foundation is pleased to support Chief Thomas and the Denver Police Department's mission to support our community in creating trust um, through our programming. This event is absolutely one of our favorite to sponsor, as it does, as Guillermo said, um, helps to meet our community where they're at in their time of need and not their time of crisis. That truly is important and critical in making sure that we as law enforcement and our police department are meeting our community in their time of need. We're so grateful to Walmart as well 
and we don't waste for their support in this event as we would not be able to source a thousand turkeys and full meals without their support. So again, we are grateful um, to our community partners, all of our volunteers and our law enforcement officers for what you do on a daily basis. Thank you. I was curious, uh, you mentioned this a little bit before about the, the distribution. And, and mm -hmm. uh, could you go into a little bit more detail? How are these, these families found and, and what's the process going to be like as far as getting this to Yeah, them? so, you know, every district has um, community resource officers. They also have uh, homeless outreach teams that literally connect with families every day and uh, understand their challenges, understand their needs, and um, quite frequently they actually come across families that have various needs, whether it's you know connection to services to help pay rent or, or purchase food or, or things like that. And so I'm you know, really grateful to the work that they do every single day, you know, connecting with the community and particularly identifying families that have specific needs. And so they've found, like I said, a thousand families that have these specific needs that we're going to be able to meet uh, for Thanksgiving. And so, you know, we've stuffed those thousand bags and uh, pretty soon we're going to get to work to delivering all of those meals. How does that, how does that affect the relationship that you have with the community? Well, I think that, you know, it, it shows a couple of things. One, I think it shows that we're part of that community and we certainly care about that community. And, and you know, we're not just here to, you know, police the community and enforce rules. We really want to see the community uh, be supported. And that the $15,000 donation to the police foundation, is that how this distribution is funded? Yes. So, uh, you know, again, we, you know, we take donations from Walmart, from AT&T, certainly um, the Denver Police Foundation has been a significant partner in all of our endeavors. And so um, we all come together, you know, and donate these, these particular funds for this event. And then, you know, and then the officers go and make the distribution. Thank you. 